Ladies and gentlemen, we're back with amnesia. I hate it. Sadly. But I love it at the same time. It's like a brother. Okay, oh wait, no, I was supposed to go into that place I was supposed to go into. Crap! Well, yeah, you're supposed to go into that place. Yeah, yeah, that does make sense. It's very scary, though. So. so. Have you ever... Next time you come over, you're playing this game. No. Next time you come over, you're playing this game. You, you know you can't tell you. Mr. B! What? So, how are you gonna get me to play it? What? I don't know how to. You're not going to. Yeah. Okay. I don't play horror games. Well, that's not a good idea scary. not to. Lack of the chimney to properly fuse. You guys can read this. Or not, it doesn't matter. I don't like reading either. You guys can read this if you want. It's Cameron's Cameron's shot. I got it. No one's gonna kill me. I got a chip. Oh shit! Oh god. Hey, what can I say? I hate it. I hate this game. Yeah. I should probably I should probably figure out a way to not get scared out of this game. Yeah, just laugh at it. Yeah. <laughs> you don't scare me. Coke's fear with Coke's fear with happiness. What's happiness in this game? Exactly. Oh uh, crap. Hopefully I'm not losing insanity, but I think I am. You are. Stay in the light for a bit, you'll gain your sanity back. But you wanna you wanna keep it like this so you you stay alive in the game. Um, so next the, the next part where we are going to go. Is Why game? Why are you son of a gun who made this game? Why are you so good at it? <laughs> they said they were good at it. What? Just because they made it doesn't mean they're good at it. True. But, I mean, you gotta think, an indie company that made this game without, like, any help, is pretty, that's pretty good. Well, I give them props for that, but... Eh. I couldn't make the game like that. Yeah, I, I would. I, I just go first. These guys are. These guys must have been like, heh, <laughs> these silly son of a bitches. They're gonna be screaming their eyes out. Yeah, I'm screaming. They weren't drunk like they were when they made my friend. Please endorse that I don't die. Is that a good idea? I don't like the sound of this, people. Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me! I'm not dead! I can make it! Don't worry, he'll die soon. 
Yeah, I probably will. I, 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 I'm getting scared already. I got goosebumps. Yeah, um, that, uh... Also, if you guys hate horror games, this is important, by the way. I got, that's right. I gotta go up to this room. Come on, Shane, you're doing now. Let's play just to know how to play the game. I am. I hate the game, though. That was obvious. A little bit. A little bit, just a little bit. I'm ending the thing right now. We're all good, right? Yeah, we seen enough, right? Nope. Ah! Oh. I think we're all in agreement. We're all in agreement of what? That you should not stop. There's a guy, and he's creeping me. Is it creeper? Does he blow up? No. He doesn't blow up Minecraft, dude. He, he stays alive. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Okay, so pretty much this is telling the story of his life on the way. And uh, it's, it's, and in a scary way, it's pretty much going to happen. No matter what, you're going to have a scary thing happen to you, and uh, let me just say, I'm scared of my life. I'm scared. I'm telling you, this is this game is epic for scaring. If you guys like getting scared? Okay. You'll, you'll love it. To tell you the truth, I think my, my ex wouldn't have any trouble with this game. Yeah, I get it. Sound. They Who plays sound. the dang oh, piano? Tell me. Sorry, sorry, awesome man. I, I, you're gonna, you're, you're. Every once in a while, you know you're gonna be like laughing at me. Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. You laugh at me, right? My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. 
Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. So pretty much he was trapped, trying to find this orb. Me growing more insane in the moment. Oh! Do not open that door! Somebody's playing the dang on piano! Why would somebody play the piano? This is a piano. What do you got against pianos? No, I mean, he actually played. There's a ghost here that plays the pianos. I think. Oh, I must have missed that when I was watching. You guys play it. No, 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 no. I, I, you don't get to hear it unless you're going really slow, and I'm going really slow for the enjoyment of the players, but, I mean, at the same time, oh, okay. at the same time, it's really kind of scary. I love you. Don't come around the corner. You played the piano very nicely. Oh shit! Oh god, he's coming! He's coming! Oh my god! That sounded wrong. <laughs> That's what she said, but no! Oh, my sanity's dropped to hell. Oh my lord. Oh god. Okay, this concludes the second half of my series because I am scared as shit. Okay, um, I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, Awesome Man and me will be back again with it some other time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please subscribe and see you guys next time.